I shared this video about how I would take videos to then compose the best possible pictures for good painting outcomes, and then I mentioned I would actually share a little bit about how to turn them into painting, so let's do that. Starting off, I'm going to take one of those reference photos from that video. Good news is that's done most of the work for us because the composition is all set. Notice this composition kind of follows that rule of thirds I talked about. First thing I'm going to do is prep my paper and quickly sketch out kind of the general areas of those different mountains and hills. Now, I could try to recreate this exactly, but what I like to do, especially for little studies like this, is pick a couple things I want to focus on and capture. For this one, I really like the feeling of the sky, and I also like the way the light was hitting that mesa. So those two things are already my focus. I'm going to start with a little underpainting of some yellow on that mesa so that I always get that light quality through the rest of the layers of that light shining. Let that dry. Then it's time for my favorite part of most paintings, the sky. I'm going to start by wetting the entire area. I'm going to drop in some blues, and then I'm also going to have a paper towel handy so I can kind of tap on the borders of where I want that to be softened. 